Motorists on a stretch of interstate are finding a rough ride thanks to some unslightly blemishes. Those potholes seem to be popping up at an unusually fast pace. Yeah, the good news, help is on the way. Justin Williams joins us live tonight along the freeway with details of the big fix. There's no doubt that drive can be kind of dicey if you're heading down I-94 through Racine County with the road surface pretty heavy on the potholes. But starting very soon, there's going to be a fill-in for your frustration. Drivers on I-94 in Racine County are finding plenty of potholes. Oh, you can see them all over the place. You know, a blind man see them holes. Bill Powers says he dodges them during his daily trips down this stretch of interstate and says his frustration has forced out a few choice phrases. Yeah, I can't repeat it here. <laughs> no, just the same old shit. But the situation is scheduled to change. They're going to fix it, I imagine. Indeed. The fix is fixing to start Tuesday evening. At about uh, 7 o'clock, we're going to start shutting down some of the lanes. That will be the two left lanes, the one that's near the median and the center lane, to do the pothole repair. Michael Pirates is a spokesperson for Wisconsin's Department of Transportation, which, he explains, has contracted Racine County's Department of Public Works to patch the potholes. They're going to start at the Milwaukee County line and work south until they get to Highway KR, and they're going to jump to the northbound lanes then and go back up towards the Milwaukee County line and just addressing any of the potholes or needs that they see along that stretch of roadway. Those crews will certainly see their share of potholes, many of which measure more than a few feet long. Pirates explains poor road conditions are the result of the frequent freezing and thawing cycles, which are a seasonal staple in these parts, particularly on an interstate road, which he describes as being at the end of its useful life cycle. This sort of highlights just how much maintenance is needed right now you know, when we're done reconstructing that stretch, which is coming up over the next couple of years, you're going to have a much smoother ride. There won't be as many of these issues that develop, and you're going to get a nice long life cycle out of that once again. Pirate says the pothole patching project is set to start tonight at 7 o'clock and actually run through the next three nights from 7 p.m. until 5 or around 5 a.m. He also explains that the lane closures, those two lane closures, they will only continue for a stretches of maybe a couple or a few hundred yards, so they won't be very long lane closures. He does remind drivers to remain alert and be patient. That is the latest from along I-94 in Racine County. I'm Justin Williams, Fox 6 News. So tonight, while the president is talking about the State of the Union, the state of I-94 will be, shall we say, improving bit by bit? I think it's safe to say that. And it will be, it'll take a few nights, so hopefully the president's speech doesn't continue quite that long. All right, slow down. Keep an eye out for those workers. All right, give them a break. Thank you, Justin. 515, time for news and weather together. Milwaukee County Sheriff's Office investigating a rollover crash on the interstate. It happened just before noon on 43 southbound.